close up folks and hope you're having a good day as usual. Now, ultimate theories. What is the next ultimate going to be? Let's have a chat about that. So I put out some polls, put them out on uh, Twitter and YouTube, and we had some interesting results. So I did put in my my theory, uh, which is Kate Wiswind, I believe it is. My theory of Kate Wiswind, and we'll cover that one first, and then we'll cover the popular option and what what is probably going to be the more realistic one, which is Forden. But man, Kate Westwind. That fight was a joke even on its release and it's been memed upon for so long now, so long. It would just be absolutely awesome if, you know, the designer that was known for making really difficult content, I forgot his name, apologies. He turns around and he's like, okay, you guys memed on uh, uh, this trial for so many years. How about we turn that into an ultimate? And you start fighting him. And it turns out to be super difficult. <laughs> that would be pretty awesome. You could fight him. Uh, I think it'd be funny if you fight him as you do now and you kill him really quickly. But then he gets up from his knee. And because you fight him on this little thin piece of island, uh, he destroys that and you fall down into the sea or some, some type of sea arena. And then you fight him and his ads. I think that would be absolutely awesome. Uh, and then you get all these kind of steroided out versions of his... Um, of his attacks and adds. Now, I would really like that type of theory, but realistically, let's we probably won't get it. Let's face it. So we know that Square Enix are quite, what's the word? They're quite slow at developing content. So when they do develop the ultimates, they take what they've got, do some enhancements to it, do some model changes at the end. But there is a core, There's the core models are already there. If you were to take something like Kate Wiswind, you need to then create the next 11 minutes of the fight. And there aren't, to my knowledge, again, my law is not very good in general, but there aren't many partners that come in can come in and help Kate Westwind regarding that. And that takes me on to the next theory. So as much as I would like Kate Westwind, just for the memes, realistically, it's probably not going to be there. But there were some other options on the poll, and most of you said Forden, because Forden has a... He seems to have a link with the other options that you told me about law-wise. Um, so a lot of you did go for Forden and said that it's got so many law links to the game. And again, yes, that is true. Um, so this is probably going to be the one we'll get if I'm, if I'm estimating it. It's got that kind of setup there. It's got Forden. It's got the knights. It's got the weapons. It's got those other links into the other options that you guys were on about, which I'll put up on the screen throughout the video. It would just be awesome. I mean, when Forden came out, Forden was, uh, you know, in my opinion, and looking at what was being said in the community at the time, Forden was one of those uh, benchmark quality primals. <laughs> primals? Trials, sorry. Trials. Um, you know when you have a wrestling match and they say, oh my god, this was a 5 out of 5 uh, wrestling match. Forden was like the benchmark quality for what an amazing trial was. A good blend of difficulty and just absolute awesomeness. Now, Forden has, um, Forden has all the makings for an ultimate. Uh, you've got the night angle. You know, do we have to fight different knights with their different weapons? And because there are different weapons, do you have to kill them in a certain order? There's so me there's so much like hidden mechanics you can put into that to kill certain knights and whatnot. And then brings the opportunity to have an ultimate fight with a council if they wanted to go that route. Um, at the moment, the the route definitely feels like you know you see in a TEA uh, brute justice turns into like a Power Ranger mech with the other ones. And you see in Ultima, I think it's Ultima, he eats Ifrit, Gruda, and Titan, I think. And in Yukob, um, I can't remember the last phase transition into the golden golden Yukob, but there's definitely been a trend that, you know, the the bosses form together at the end. And that leaves the opportunity for obviously the the warring triad, which some of you have mentioned. Uh, and that the fact that this Forden boss can go so many different ways with the ads, the warring triad. Uh, the Nidhogg Eye and all that sort of stuff. So um, certainly I would probably bet on it being Forden. Um, I'm not sure what else they could do in the remit of Ultimates with their development issues right now. Like we know development wise that um, Square Enix aren't doing too well. A lot of content creators have spoke up about, you know, the content is, this is excluding COVID as well. The content is a bit slow. So uh, with that being thought of, I think they would reuse the assets from Forden and the Knights, get the Knights from the Vault as well, uh, start mashing them into something, 
and then you just make a golden Forden at the end or something. <laughs> or Forden just like fuses with something and then it gets wings. I don't know. It'd be pretty awesome. Um, but certainly Forden has the potential, if it is that option, to be a really solid ultimate, in my opinion. Uh, I think there's just so much there for it. But I'm interested in what you guys think. So it seems as though you have stated that you probably think it's going to be Forden. So let's let's skip asking what you think it will be. And let's skip to what do you think the flow of the fight will be? Do you think it'll be Warring Triad? Do you think it'll just be Forden and his knights? Do you think the knights will be a whole council fight? Um, do you think it will be Golden Forden at the end? Or a different type of Forden? There's all these amazing opportunities that could be done in the future for this next ultimate uh, and i would like to take the time to say yes ultimates great content people are still doing ucob to this day so uh square enix as much as we can criticize them uh which is is healthy their ultimates that they've put in place were one of the best decisions i think they've made to help that side of the community so very good stuff with that and i'm looking forward to seeing what happens in the future one so yeah uh, i think it will be forden i think there'll be lots of opportunity there uh, I don't, as much as I like Kate Westwind, I don't think it'll be Kate Westwind, but you know, it is what it is. So let me know what you think mechanic wise they can do with Forden. The law links, the knight links, uh, council fights, weapon swaps with different knights. Let me know what you think. But yeah, uh, thanks for the poll questions, uh, the poll answers, and it's quite good seeing what we think is going to be, be happening. So yeah, tune into this video uh, a year later, whenever the next ultimate comes out, I don't know, and we'll see if we were right. But other than that, folks, thanks again for all the support. And I'll see you in the next one.